singles. We're going to see what options you have in love for the 17th through the 24th. Let's see if we get the same set of Aries or a different set this time, guys. This is for the 17th through the 24th. As far as your options are concerned, okay? Let's see what's going on for Aries, love, singles. For the 17th through the 24th, Aries, singles. Please show me what Aries, singles have as far as options in love. Let's see. Aries, singles. Hang on, guys. Let me grab my other set of eyes. Singles. That out of the way. Aries singles. All right, here we go, guys. Well, happy for some reason. I hope you guys are happy. Oh, yes, Nine of Cups. There we go. Two of Pentacles. King of Pentacles. King of Wands. Okay. <laughs> Instantly, what I see is that you're happy and you're enjoying yourself. And I see an earth sign here that is not giving you the attention right now. It's trying to decide what it is that they want to do and they could possibly be dealing with someone else. But I, I really feel like it's like work in you, okay? But while they're deciding, see, what's really, really getting to them right now is the fact that they think that you have another suitor coming in, another fire sign. We have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius here in this Queen of Wands, that energy. And then we have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn here. Um, we also have Pisces here, but it looks like whoever these people are, you already know them, man or woman, but one feels like they have um, more invested with you, and then the other one, though, they are... Um, I don't want to say jealous, but this person's obviously somebody else that either they have heard about you dating or that you have dated before. So it's like that's putting a fire under their ace, okay? Because they see somebody else that's interested in you. And I feel like, you know, you also feel like you have different options out there. Whether you know it or not, you probably just feel it like innately, like, you know. And you're just waiting on somebody to approach you here. I feel like you're very grounded. I feel like you're very stable. You're very patient. You're not pushing yourself on anyone. You're not really you know, expecting anything in particular, but I feel like you're open to it. I feel like you know that you're, you're attractive, you know what it is that you want. And so you're sitting right here and I feel like this, this is you, man or woman. Okay. Sitting right in between these two kings. And I feel like either way, you're just like, huh, you know, you're going to be able to decide, you know, which one you go with, if either one of them. 
Because right now, I don't think you're really thinking about anybody in particular. You're very um, guarded as far as letting anyone in that, you know, that you haven't completely just checked out. Like, okay, check this off the list. Check that off the list. Okay, you're good. You know, I'm, I'm going to allow you to, to come in and swoon me kind of thing. Yeah. So I feel like you have, you have air here. You have, um, in particular, I see Leo. Okay. Leo, Capricorn energy, Sagittarius energy here. And, um, Pisces. Okay. I also see, um, like Libra, Gemini energy present. Okay. So that is what you guys have as far as um, love options for the 17th through the 24th. This, I mean, instantly it's like you're feeling yourself, but not in a bad way. I see it, you know, like you're very confident in yourself right now. And I love it. I absolutely love it. All right, Aries. So those are your options for the 17th through the 24th.